Hi, I'm Phil Ashey from the American Anglican Council with your weekly Anglican Perspective. Today we're all in shock over the horrible uh, tornado that struck devastating Moore, Oklahoma and uh, causing so many deaths and uh, people having lost everything, grieving uh, this terrible natural disaster. And of course it, it raises the question, why does God allow these kinds of things to happen? The short answer to that is we live in a fallen world where because of human sin, uh, the world itself is out of order. That's why Paul says in, in Romans 8 that the whole creation is groaning in expectation for the sons of God to be revealed and that groaning includes things like terrible earthquakes and floods, tsunamis, um, tornadoes. The real question is not why, because even if we could answer that question in an intellectually satisfying way, it would not touch the pain that people are feeling right now in Moore, Oklahoma. But the real question is where? Where is God involved in a situation like this? We have a great example in the book of Job, who also suffered a terrible uh, tornado come upon his family and take everything from him. At one point, Job looks for God in that and says, naked I came into the world and naked I leave. Uh, the Lord gives, the Lord takes away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. And then he says to his wife when she says, why don't you just curse God and die? He says, shall we thank God only for the good and not for the evil? Job learns how to see God in the midst of this and in the end recognizes God who puts all of his questions uh, to silence and ultimately out of that blesses Job richly. God's will is to bless us out of suffering, to help us come to identify with him and, and his suffering nature in Jesus Christ. We can find God in the efforts of Christians like the Anglican Relief and Development Agency who are on the ground right now and uh, with Anglicans on the ground helping these survivors. So please give, please pray, please help them to see where God is at work in their lives right now.